hey, I'd like to share some good news with you. Good news that has happened in my world, in my wife's world. Uh, many of you are familiar uh, uh, with the fact that over the years, my wife has went through some fairly serious health issues, off and on in a lot of situations. And uh, uh, this last surgery that she had, there was really a long, long, long time of recuperation after it. And uh, 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 prior to that, and by the way, I'm talking long periods of time. I'm not talking weeks, I'm not talking months. I'm talking for years. She couldn't be left alone at home at night. I had to have somebody with her. So that put a lot of pressure uh, on me and the business that I'm in. We always had to plan accordingly. I had to have somebody here. She had to have her life alerts on and all the different things that you do in situations like this. And uh, this went on for a number of years. And like I said, she had her very last surgery and her recovery was very, very long. And then last year, one week before Thanksgiving, I noticed her one day, I seen a little perk in her step, uh, a little enthusiasm. She was eating a little bit better and I didn't say anything. You know, you know we pray every day, day, day. And, and uh, uh, this was good news. I said, thank you, Lord, it'll be a good day today. Next day, I seen a little perk again, and next day, a little perk again. Then that Saturday, we're having breakfast, and she says to me, Al, I'd like to go to Ron and Dolores, my brother and sister-in-law's house, for Thanksgiving. And uh, Ron's got seven kids, and they're going to all be over there with their kids' kids. I mean, there's a whole bunch of people that gather around the Thanksgiving uh, a dinner at his house. And she, she says, I'd really like to go and see everybody at Thanksgiving. I went, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you know, she wasn't supposed to be around a lot of people. And every, she's feeling really good. And so we went, we spent Thanksgiving there. Uh, uh, she ate great, stayed much longer than I thought she was gonna stay. She was blessed to be there to see everybody. Well, from that day on, she got better and better and better and better. And uh, we're in on regular checkups with her to the doctor. She's still got some issues, but the doctors are all looking at it. They shake their head. And I've got a couple doctors that are people of faith. And they look and they said, Mary, keep on praying, man. It's working. Don't change what you're doing. And uh, I thank God that, uh, uh, yeah, 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 you know, uh, I go to a church where, 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 where they're not afraid to lay hands on a sick and pray for people to be recovered. If that's the situation, you got a problem, raise your hand, and there is people that will pray over you, They'll know, depending on how serious it is. And, but you are open to prayer. We believe in prayer. And, and, and in my wife's faith level, in getting a, a healing in her body, in line with believing that Jesus is still in the healing business, is amazing. I have never seen anybody this strong in my life and I'm not kidding you she is she is one tough lady for a little little thing a little over a hundred pounds but the strongest thing she has is her faith in God and her trust in God and uh, uh, we believe beyond a shadow of a doubt that prayer for many friends of ours that have prayed for us through this situation in our day, daily prayer we stand on the word we come every day Thank you, Lord, this is the day you made. We will rejoice and be glad and we go about our business with thanksgiving. I just had to share that with you. We believe in the power of prayer. I believe beyond a shadow of a doubt that Jesus is the same today as he was yesterday. He's still in the healing business. And you gotta release your faith, build on it, believe it, believe it, believe it. It's gotta become real to you and you gotta act on it. I just had to share that with you. It's a good piece of news in a Linder household. The doctors give her a big thumbs up. Hey, I had to share that with you. Hey, from all of us here at the edge, you have a good, safe fishing season. We'll see you on the water. And if you really like what you see, we got a whole lot more. So check us out at any one of these online outlets.